The Islamic Studies Academy and the Islamic Online University are the brainchild of Dr. Bilal Phillips. Both were established in the year 2007. During his Islamic studies in various colleges and universities, he realized that the syllabi of Islamic studies are prolonged, especially for English-speaking people. This was to save time because normally a person who wants to study in Arabic Islamic institutions, study for two years or three years, just Arabic alone. This realization has given birth to the idea to design and create a shorter course. But it was not an easy task to break the stereotype and create a new course. Dr. Bilal had to face many challenges at many levels. After many years of hard work, he was finally able to present a complete picture of a shorter course for Islamic studies. That idea didn't find sufficient backing for us to actually set up an institute. So I proposed to the American University in Dubai and a university in Ajman called Preston University, a branch of a, a mother university called Preston University in the US. But unfortunately, I didn't find uh, the support to do it. Uh, within a year's time, by 2003, summer, I moved to uh, Qatar. And that idea I tried to also develop here. But that, it didn't materialize. Islamic Studies Academy was finally started by Dr. Bilal in 2007 with the approval of Umm Darman University, Sudan. I linked the course up with Umm Durman Islamic University. Dr. Bilal Phillips not only designed a shorter syllabus but also improved the content keeping in mind the responsibilities towards modern socio-economic challenges. We did add a number of courses like uh, management in Islam, uh, Islamic economics, teaching methodology and some other subjects which we felt would give the graduate you know, a, a more rounded education to be able to function in a more multifaceted uh, environment. It was due to his vision that whatever was taught in a BA course at the Islamic Studies Academy was filmed and was also used by the Islamic Online University. In a way, his dream of seeing his syllabus being taught in a university was realized through the use of modern online technology. I had in the back of my mind the idea that this would ultimately go up on the internet and be able to reach a far larger audience. We have now launched the course which was taught online under the general heading of the Islamic Online University. This course, uh, you can do it uh, as in the classroom as well as uh, the distance learning and this make it very practical for the people who are working and they can take the DVDs and they can study at home and give the exams at their convenience. From the first year, we had some 1,500 students join the, the free courses, the short courses, and by the third year, uh, we had reached 15,000 and by the time the uh, ISA completed itself, we have over 26,000 students who are registered from over 160 different countries around the world. 
today within a short span of mere three years islamic online university has 28401 students registered with it as of 1st october 2010 to get information about the university visit www.islamiconlineuniversity.com to know more about Dr. Bilal Phillips, visit his official website www.bilalphillips.com The journey continues for those who dare to accept the challenges.